Welcome back, everybody, to the show. This is AM Live, and we have Pastor Karen with us. This is Karen Siegfried of the Trinity Episcopal Church in Sutter Creek. How are you I'm today? I'm doing great. Thank great. you. Uh, now, you're here today to talk to us about Fill the Reservoir. Can yes. Can you tell us what that's about? Yes. Well, you know, summer is drought time, isn't it? Well, it's also drought time uh, for donations to the food bank here in Amador County, the Interfaith Food Bank. And so each year we come together to try to uh, increase their donations. Mm -hmm. And so Fill the Reservoir is uh, today and tomorrow at Safeway. Okay, today and tomorrow. That's good to yes. know. So, so Friday and Saturday. Nine to six. And we'll be asking people as they shop at Safeway uh, to donate something. You know, there's things buy one, get mm -hmm. one free. So get one and donate mm -hmm. it to the food bank or uh, just put it in a can of tuna or some peanut butter or something that you feel moved mm -hmm. to. Um, and so what is this food drive all about? So our goal is to, um, to eliminate hunger in Amador County. And that's what the mission of the food mm -hmm. bank is. Uh, we want to see a time when people do not go to uh, uh, bed hungry, that they can feed their children. And children, of course, in the summer do not get their... Uh, S some people are, are, are entitled to luncheons, and mm -hmm. so now they need even more food. Or our elderly do not have to choose between mm -hmm. uh, paying their housing and eating. And right. so we want to put an end to hunger. We want to put our faith into action. Mm -hmm. So we pray for people, but we also roll up our sleeves and try to make a difference in Amador County. That's just fantastic. Now, why is your church, why is Trinity involved? So that is our main outreach is to feed the hungry oh. and uh, also heal the sick. So. Um, but uh, years ago, uh, we had a vision along with several other churches in this county to put together a food bank to address hunger. Um, mm. We also uh, had a thrift store, which made quite a bit of money, and we donated that uh, to the food bank uh, to run. All the churches are running it together. Now, that's the Great Finds that's thrift the, store that's down by the from, taco truck. That's where I was. Exactly. It's across from Walgreens. <laughs> okay. And it's a wonderful thrift store to bring your stuff to and all the proceeds go to the interfaith food bank you know, to that's feed the great hungry. to know and you know something about that thrift store that i didn't realize is that you can take a bag of rags that they actually can sell those and make money so if you have something that isn't really good enough to even I donate see. put it in a bag and call it rags right. uh -huh. and they can just sell it right off the bat yeah yeah yeah, yeah. yeah. So what we try to do is to do different things to help the hunger. We, um, you know, people bring cans of food every Sunday. We bless it, send it on to the food bank. People mm -hmm. collect money and donations, and we mm -hmm. give a part of our budget, feed the hungry. Mm -hmm. um, so there's lots of opportunities to feed the hungry, and most of them are pretty simple. Mm -hmm. If every time you go shopping, you take a couple of cans of tuna, mm -hmm. put it in your basket, donate it to the food bank. So that would be something set a person could do if they couldn't make it to the food drive this weekend exactly they could still bring food on any kind of random basis to the food bank that's right and where is the food bank located you know where the airport is I do so it's on airport road you go up there and boom there it and is boom yeah. right there uh -huh. um, so let me ask you something about yourself how did you make it to Amador County I think it was a dream about <laughs> I'm from uh, the Bay Area mm -hmm. and um, Silicon Valley, and I thought, you know, it's time to go back to the land, and somebody said, well, Karen, you've never been in the land, and I said, you're right, but uh, there was something that was drawing me, and there was this opportunity to mm -hmm. become the rector at Trinity in, uh, in Sutter Creek, and so I took it. And um, That's a wonderful story. Yeah. That's so. great. Um, so is there anything else that we can talk about about the food drive, just in, you know, in a summary? So Friday and Saturday today, mm -hmm. tomorrow, 9 to 6. Just be generous. Just let your heart, you know, we can't solve all the problems in the world. Mm -hmm. And sometimes when you look at hunger, you just are overwhelmed. But if you think that 18% of the people here in Amador County have used the food bank. 18%. 18%. Wow. And um, 1.5 million pounds of food have been distributed to the people. My goodness. And they, and they uh, serve at least 70 mm -hmm. families a, a, a day. So. You can't solve the whole problem, but you can buy a couple of cans of tuna or a couple right. of uh, things of peanut butter or mm -hmm. some beans or something. And just to finish off in our last minute or so, what are the most wanted items? Things that have protein in them. 
I see. So peanut butter, tuna, chili, you know, those things mm -hmm. that come in a can. Right. So those are the most wanted, but anything is appreciated because people use pasta to mix up with those uh, proteins. Mm -hmm. And beans, are, are, are rice and beans, or pasta sauce. Sometimes I think they call a meal in a can, anything yes, like a meal. beef stew. Exactly. That's really good to also yeah, to donate. Yeah. And how about if you had chickens? Could you donate your eggs? 